the mood to shoot a new video and um, one of my friends actually asked me to give her some tips on how to lay back on the oily skin, um, how to just tone it down a little bit um, and just get it under control. It's summertime, summertime's about to end, but that's okay because some of these tips are just year round. Um, but let's be real, just to start off with, if you have oily skin, you're probably not going to be able to get rid of it. It's not something that goes away overnight, you know, you just have to deal with it, learn how to control it, and just learn how to get it to where you're comfortable with it because it's just not going away. That's just the facts. So let's get started. I've got really oily skin sometimes and these are just some things that I do. So if you do it and you try it and it works out for you, then great. And if not, then I'm sorry. But this is just my take on oily skin and how to deal with it. Um, you can also tweak these different tips to your liking. You may not like some of the things I have to say and that's fine. But just this is what I have to say and I hope you like it. tip is to use a light moisturizer in the morning before you go out and before you apply your makeup and use your heavy moisturizers at night. So for example, at nighttime whenever I wash my face, I exfoliate, cleanse, do whatever I gotta do and then I apply a really heavy cream moisturizer. I do this because I also have combination skin. So in order for me to uh, produce enough oil for my skin to stay hydrated it's kind of like I have to overdo it sometimes but I overdo it at night because guess what nobody can see me at night so it doesn't really matter how oily my face is and also if you use a moisturizer that doesn't clog your pores and you don't have to worry about getting pimples and having bad breakouts from it so um, the moisturizer that I use at night, it's, um, it's actually a generic version <laughs> um, of Olay's um, Beauty Lotion. I use that. It's the Equate version from Walmart. That's what I use. And then in the morning time, I might use like a light gel moisturizer. Um, the one that I use now is this Garnier Fructis um, gel moisture. But this is like a really, really, really lightweight moisturizer. You can see just really light and fluffy. And the consistency is like almost like water. So as soon as you put it on your face, it kind of melts into um, your skin and then your skin absorbs it and you don't have to worry about your skin being oily for the rest of the day. So what you want to do is find an, an alcohol-free toner. That way you can clean your face, not worry about having dry skin. And then also, the more you use it and the more your skin gets used to it, that oil will start to break down and your, your face is still going to be oily, but it might not be as oily as it was before. My third tip is to make sure you carry a little bit of powder around with you. Every girl should have a powder compact in her purse. This is the one that I have. It's Maybelline Fit Me in number 325. And I just used this along with the powder puff. It came with one, but I broke it because it was just really kind of weak. So I got this one instead. And what you just do, just pat just a little bit of powder onto your powder puff and just pat yourself up. You don't want to do this excessively because you don't want to look too kinky in the face. But just do a light dab around just to keep that oil under control when you're out. Nothing's more embarrassing than just going out and looking super greasy in front of people. I've had so many embarrassing moments where I just look mad greasy in front of people and nobody ever said anything. I guess because they were just trying to be polite. And I didn't know any better. I was like younger, but this is what I do now just to keep it under control. Do the bridge of my nose, right under my chin, and you definitely gotta get that forehead because that's where my shine starts to increase. So those are my three tips and I hope you enjoyed it. Um, coming back soon with more videos. I've been gone. I say this every time I know y'all probably sick of hearing it. But um, I'm just a busy girl. I just work a lot. So forgive me, forgive me. And I will be back soon with more videos. Thanks.